I'm the calculus professor and today we'll be talking about working with integrals. In problem number 17, I'd like to use symmetry to find the integral from negative pi to pi of sine of x dx. And before I actually go ahead and do this problem, let's just take a look at that graph. Um, sine of x does this sort of thing. That's what sine of x looks like. Of course, it keeps going. But I'm just concerned with this thing between negative pi and pi. Well, negative pi is back here. Pi is up here. And as we can see, that this thing is uh, symmetric about the origin, uh, or in other words, the positive values over here are the negative of the negative values over here. Um, and so this thing's symmetric about the origin. In other words, it's an odd function. Uh, and since it's an odd function, I know something about it. I know that if this thing's an odd function, then if I'm taking the integral from negative pi to pi of, of an odd function, that that's just going to give me zero. And zero is the answer, but it makes some sense too if I just look at the graph. This is adding up, so to speak, some negative area, and this is adding up a symmetric positive area. And so we should be able to, without doing any integration at all, just look at this thing and see that the integral is going to be zero, and it is.